Welcome guys to this short clip about learning Python. Uh, we learn Python by by examples, real examples. So in this part, we uh, the, the main uh, aim of this uh, clip is to uh, to learn the usage of if and how and when to comment. So the usage of if and comment will be focused. It's a good practice to describe a program by a couple of comments or sentences at the beginning of the code so that if someone else gets the job to continue on your code, uh, he or she will easily be able to understand what it is about and uh, without uh, reading or scanning the whole code. Uh, so th this example is about uh, the popular, the most popular sports checker. So we have three popular sports, uh, and the user checks uh, enters a sport and sees if if uh, the sport that the user enters is one of the most popular sports in the world. Uh, so we begin by uh, commenting, and uh, in Python we begin commenting with a hash or a number sign. So we write uh, write a description of this program. This program is checks if the sport the user enters is one of the three most most popular sports in the world. two lines so that you can uh, see it and each line should begin with a new hash sign otherwise um, it will be translated or compiled as a program code so this program checks if the uh, the sport that the user enters is one of the th uh, three most popular sports in the world or not okay uh, we enter a, a some text that uh, when, the, when you run the program, that the, the user should understand what it is. So right, popular sport checker. Like this. And then we uh, let the user enter the name of the sport. So uh, here we need a variable uh, to save the, the sport that is being entered by the user. So the, the variable, we name the variable sports name like this. Uh, and here we have an input. Enter the sport name. This is our enter. When we get uh, the name of the sport, now we compare it with the three sports that we. Uh, so we write the pop most popular sports name here. Uh, uh, most popular, we write it uh, football. Uh, and uh, for sake of example, uh, I don't know if it's right or not. Cricket and and hockey. So uh, these are the three most uh, popular sports in the world. So we compare uh, that the sports name that the user enters with these three. Uh, if whether it, it, it is or not. So you'll see here. If the sport name that we get that the user enters. So we compare it with double equal sign. Uh, which shows the equality if it's equal to what? If it's equal to football and if it's one, so uh, that's it. Uh, otherwise, if it's more than one, then we compare more than one, so we write or uh, and again 
copy this part, paste it, and then change the cricket to football. Uh, football to cricket. And the third one, or so um, copy this one, and then change the name of uh, cricket to hockey. So these are the three most popular sports in the world. Uh, now, when we write a column, uh, so we get an indentation. Otherwise, if you do not, if we forget to write that, uh, we do not uh, get indentation. So that uh, in that case, so uh, the if uh, that not does not work. So uh, be sure to not forget this column. Okay. Uh, now we print a message. Print a message to the user that uh, the sport name that the user entered sport name plus and this is our message is uh, one of the most popular sports in the world okay in this case it is Otherwise, what we do, we have an else. Don't forget the colon after else to get the indentation. So else we uh, write uh, another message. And here we copy instead of writing it again. We copy this if and change it. This sport is not. We write not in capital. It is not one of the most popular sports in the world. So let's see. This is the... Uh, this is our code. Let's see if uh, if it uh, gives the right result that we need. So we run it. Okay. Popular sport checker. Okay. We write popular sport. We write, um, for example, um, uh, volleyball. Volleyball is not one of the most popular sports in the world. Okay. So this was volleyball. Now we write uh, something else that is popular. We write football. Football is one of the most popular sports in the world. Uh, okay, this was football and we write, uh, for example, hockey. Hockey is one of the most popular sports in the world. So that's it for today. Hope you have learned something. Uh, please share and comment and let me know if uh, you need any other help with uh, Python programming. Have a great time.